so you could actually make over your memory? You could actually do things to improve your memory? You know because I, I am obsessed with the idea that I'm losing my mind. No, you really aren't. I mean, the thing well, is Well, I, I may be, actually. Uh, well, you may be, okay. <laughs> well, you're an exception. Okay. Now, this is the thing, that most memory books are about mnemonic devices and how to memorize a deck of cards or a grocery list or something. This is really a book about how to tap into your past and remember things with prompting questions, exercises, quizzes, questionnaires, things that maybe you didn't think this way. I know how my memory works, so the challenge in this book was to say, okay, these are things that I kind of do naturally with my memory, so now maybe if I turn them into exercises that other people can do, they will be able to go back. Because let's face it, your story is in you, whether or not you're acknowledging it, and it's making you do things anyway. So why not remember the past so you can bring it forward to inform the future? So can you use memory to help lose weight, for instance? Oh, absolutely. I know that I did that. Once I found how, how? a better way of eating... Because you start saying, okay, I remember the last time I had this nasty food, exactly how I felt, and it was on this day or it was this occasion. You know, and you start making, I mean, some of the exercises are about journaling certain things, kind of creating a timeline of your life. See, I remember, I mean, there's some fast food restaurants that I love, and I go to, and I feel bloated and disgusting afterward, and I remember that. Yet I still go to them. Okay, so at least you made a choice. <laughs> yes. Yeah. But everybody, everyone has a track on which they embed their memories. Everyone mm. has a main memory track. And for you, it might be the news things that you've covered. Uh, for other people, it might be travel. It might be jobs that they've had. It, it might be a sports track or a relationship track. It's like in the murky forest of your memories, what pebbles have you dropped along the way to sort of help you go you, back? 